Hey, today we're doing an all green feature. You'll see why in a moment. Boomers killing the planet. The Hill reported a story on Monday featuring the alarming headline, people over 60 account for a third of greenhouse gas emissions. The article goes on to explain that boomers spend a lot more money on houses, energy, and food than did their thrifty World War II generation parents. The problem, according to experts cited in the Hill's article, is that seniors have big houses, which let them live off the equity and maintain their gassy carbon footprint lifestyles instead of moving into smaller houses and downsizing like broke, responsible 30-year-olds. This is a problem because it is literally killing sweet old grandma. Oops, sorry. What I meant to say is that your shameless, uncaring grandma is literally killing the planet. My, how times have changed. Yesterday, science said we needed to do everything to protect grandma and grandpa. But today, science says that grandma and grandpa are killing the planet. Now the planet's oppressed, and newsflash, you're related to the oppressors, your grandparents. Not sure about you, but I'm going to be needing a scorecard soon just to keep track of who to hate, who's killing who, and who we're supposed to be protecting. Anyways, according to The Hill, now I'm speaking to you selfish boomers, you're putting us all at risk just by living. Whereas people under 30, the enlightened virtue signaling ones, who've been indoctrinated to innately fear all things climate change, have compliantly reduced their carbon emissions by an average of 3.7 tons, while you boomers keep hogging all the energy and resources and polluting the climate with your lifestyle or something. So, like Mr. Miyagi says, boomers bad, under 30 good. In closing, I know some of you are quite troubled by this news and are likely pacing back and forth but before you go and wear out your Birkenstocks, don't worry. I'm certain we've likely got some experts who've been working on how to solve this gluttonous boomers problem for quite some time now. I'm sure it's only a matter of time before they come up with a worldwide solution to this pandemic. Can you say global reset? Hmm. Anyways, thanks for watching. I do appreciate it. Please post your comments in the comment section. You can also follow me on Rumble on my Locals account, and I look forward to seeing you next time.